Hey, what's up everybody? So if you guys have ever seen the show Hot Ones on YouTube, you know they have a whole lineup of hot sauces. Well, I'm really into hot stuff. I like spicy things. And so I ended up buying the entire lineup of the sauces. Well, at least for season 10 and then one extra one. Now, a friend of mine uh, actually challenged me to try that one, the Mad Dog 357. He had it and he said he had a near death experience. <laughs> said that it made him puke, it made him all this and that. And he, you know, basically curled up like a little wuss. <laughs> and so um, I've tried pretty much all of these all the way up to the bomb. And that was pretty, that was pretty tough. That was, a, that was, yeah, the, definitely the bomb is no joke. Um, I haven't tried these ones, these other three, or this, these two yet, because I wanted to do them with a couple of friends and see how they react. But Sonny, my buddy, specifically requested me to try that one. So that's the one I'm gonna do. And I'm gonna probably eat one of these over here just to kind of get warmed up and get started. I actually really like the taste of this one. These two are really good, actually. Faya Faya is pretty good too. Um, so I'm probably gonna start maybe right around here, just have one of these, maybe one of these and then just jump straight to that one right there. Let's see how it goes. All right, so we're gonna try out Los Calientes first. This is number four on the Hot Ones lineup. And I've got some little chicken wing thing here, chicken sticks, whatever, chicken skewers. So this stuff is actually pretty good. I like it. I know I'm not gonna get any kind of burn at all with this. Here we got a nice little pour. Oh yeah, good stuff. All right, no problem there. Let's pull out the next skewer and we'll try the Akamiso. This is the one right before the bomb, or the bomb. So let's try it. There we go. Ooh, you can smell this one. This one definitely smells hot. There we go, a nice little rub down there. You can see, nice. <coughs> Good stuff. So, spice kicks in a little bit later. I always thought that it had kind of a smoky flavor to it. I like it. Mad Dog 357 with plutonium nine extract. So this one's supposed to be a million on the Scoville scale, and this used to be the hottest one in the lineup of the Hot One show. Um, they don't include it in season 10, but if you were to include it, it would be Number two in the hottest, uh, besides their own, uh, the Triple X brand one. Shake well before using. Ooh, check out the ingredients. Oh man, let's see. Reaper, scorpion, and ghost peppers, red wine vinegar, white distilled vinegar, fresh chopped onions, garlic water, natural sugar, fresh lime juice, chili extract, and xanthan gum. Mm. Sounds interesting. All right, so now we've shaken it all up. It's open. And oh, it's even got a little cover there. So let's pop that off carefully. Ooh. All right, brand new. Ooh, you can smell that. That's, that's pretty hot. But the little bullet here is actually a tiny spoon. So you unscrew this. And there you go. You get this little dropper dabber thing. Uh, just a tiny little itty bitty scoop of it there. I don't know if you guys can see that. And it's just, ah, oh, it's not focusing. But it is there. You can see a little red stuff on it. And I'm gonna put it right here. It seems like it's not enough. I mean, look at that, just a little wipe, but I'm tempted to put on more, but if it's anything like what my buddies say, maybe maybe that's it. Let's put on just a tad, just a scoop off the edge here. Let's see. I'm afraid that I'm gonna regret this and be like, oh, I shouldn't have done that. But let's see. All right, <clears throat> got a little more of it. And let's put it right over the same spot. There we go. All right, it's a little thicker now. So there it is, nice little red smear. <laughs> All right, 
So, Sunny, this is for you. And let's see what happens. <laughs> I don't want to say nothing, anything yet because sometimes they hit after the fact. I mean, I tasted it immediately. Uh, I don't think that was enough. We're gonna pour directly from the bottle. 357, plutonium nine extract, supposed to be one million on the Scoville scale, hotter than the bomb. A little drop. Oh, 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 shit. Oh, damn, that's a lot. Okay, that is definitely a drop. Sunny, I hope you're happy with that. <clears throat> this should hopefully do something. Let's see. Okay. I mean, I do taste it, but... It, <clears throat> Again, just kind of like a burnt taste. It's a little bit hot. I mean, I could feel it on the back of my tongue. It is building up though. But it's not unbearable. I mean, I could probably drink a little bit of water. I'm probably gonna have a little bit of water just because, you know, to kind of, I'm thirsty. No, kind of cleared my sinuses a bit. <clears throat> But the bomb to me was way harder hitting, just like on the show. You'll see the celebrity just gonna go <laughs> and freak out over the bomb. And yeah, that one, the first time I tried it, was pretty hard hitting. Okay, so actually more of the heat is starting to come up now. So my tongue is a little bit hotter. But again, I'm not curling up in bed or vomiting. <laughs> like my buddy here. Um, although he said that <clears throat> when he got it, he got it in a taco. And the guy who put it in there for him put in five drops. So I got to put five drops of this stuff on this, at least. I've already had at least one drop and a little smear. So... I can just call that as number one, but now I'm gonna do five extra ones just for you, Sonny. So let's see, we're gonna do, and he had, the guy made it a big old deal saying that, you know, I, he had it out of a little glass. There's one drop, two drops, that was like two and a half or whatever. Three, four drops, five drops, okay. Five and just a little smear off the edge there. Oh no, don't lose any, am I losing any? Nope, they're coming down a little bit, but we're good. <clears throat> I don't want anybody to say I cheated. I'm going to do one extra one. I thought I saw one fall. So, uh, Come on. Coax it out. Bloop. That was a thick drop, too. Damn. All right, so that is a lot. I'm going to move the camera so you can see it there. Yeah, that's, that's a lot. <clears throat> oh. Okay, so let's do this. I'm gonna move it up the skewer and let's take this bite. <coughs> you can see I'm not even sweating yet. <clears throat> I can feel it. Like I said, it's not that it's not hot. I do feel it. Like the back of my tongue actually is moving towards the middle and front of my tongue now. <sighs> yeah, I can feel it. It is hot. I'll drink a little bit of water. <clears throat> but it's not, anything is not tolerable. It's like eating a hot pepper or something <clears throat> straight. You know, I'm getting a little bit of the whistles here, the And I wouldn't mind taking a sip of the milk. It is hot. It's burning my tongue a little bit now. <clears throat> yeah, it's good. Yeah, it's like, it's hot. <clears throat> Not uncomfortably so, 
Like if I really wanted to push it, I could just sit here and take it. <clears throat> but since I had the tools, so my nose is a little bit runny now, but again, nothing major. It was good. <clears throat> Actually gave me a little bit of spice. That one had no spice, just chicken. So, Sonny, <clears throat> you're a little bitch. <laughs> now it is hot and I have a lot of friends out there who don't like hot stuff and can't really tolerate it. <clears throat> and they kind of say, here, try this. And uh, if I get hot, then they know it's gonna be hot. So this one's hot. I can feel it on my tongue. I can feel it all back in there. Yeah, so like the back part of my tongue, like the right as my tongue touches my throat. <clears throat> but no watery eyes, no puking, haha. <laughs> and uh, I'm not even sweating yet. I mean, I'm a little bit hot. I can feel the warmth. And they're kind of coursing through me a little bit, but not enough to stop me. Like I said, the bomb I think was the one that I tried so far. I still have burn after eating and yeah, I gotta try this one next, and I also gotta try this one, and uh, we'll see how those go. Otherwise, I'm great. So anyways, uh, yeah, if you guys are interested in trying one of these sauces or having me try something, let me know. I'll see if I can pick a bottle of it up and see if I can challenge myself to try it. I'll, video, I'll record myself and see how the reaction turns out. <clears throat> see how it comes out. So far, already the heat is going away. So yeah, Mad Dog 357, nah. It's good, I like it, but not gonna stop me. Anyways, you guys, have a good one. See ya.